So in order to manage our extensions, I'm going to go on to the top right and here you can see this icon. If I were to click on it, you see all the extensions that are available. So right now to access the extensions, I have to go over here. I can close this out to close out the extensions. If I were to click this and then if I were to go over here, then I can access to the settings of this particular uh, um, extension. Let's say, for example, there's the currency converter right here. If I were to go to option, then I get to the option for that particular extension. But what I want to do is I want to, let's say, pin it out over here so that I can access the extension immediately. So in order to do that, I can click on the extension button and then I can click on the pin button. And once I do that, you can see that the uh, extension show up over here. So if I were to click on this, you can see that there's the Google Calendar extension. If I were to click on this, that's the currency converter. And similarly, I can click over here and unpin that out as well. So I can pin it and I can unpin it. And then what I can do is I can go over to more actions and then I can pin it from there as well. Or if I completely want to remove out the extension, I can click on remove from Chrome and it asks me whether I want to actually remove it. So I'm just going to go around and remove this and now the extension is there no more. I can also go around into manage extensions and once I do that, you can see all of the extensions that I have are here. So I can disable the extension if I want to or enable the extension. So you can see that there's Google Calendar. I just disabled it. You do not see the extension over here anymore. But if I were to enable this out, you can see that now I can access the extension. So I can see the details of this extension as well and then change out the settings. I can go back or I can remove the uh, extension completely. You get the same option and remove it out. You want to search for a particular extension that you've installed. If that there's a lot of extension, this is quite helpful. You can simply go over here and type in the extension right here. So in my case, I'm uh, searching Acrobat and you can see it is right here. And in my case, it is turned on. So you can see that as I type in only uh, the uh, extensions with that particular name is filtered out. And that is how you can pin and unpin extensions and remove extensions inside of Google Chrome. So if you guys learn something as always, and as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.